what is given in this question? 100 times its 100th term. So we can say over here 50 times of 50th term that is A50. And it is nothing but the 150th term of this AP. So I can say that it is A150 and that is equal to 0. So in this question, it is given that if 100 times the 100th term of an AP with a non-zero common difference is equal to 50 times its 50th term, then we have to find the 150th term of this AP. So suppose the first term of this AP is A and the common difference is D over here. Now what is given in this question? 100 times its 100th term. So 100 times of 100 term we can write like this A100 that is equal to 50 times its 50th term. So we can say over here 50 times of 50th term that is A50. So we can cancel out like this 2 times over here. So what will be the 100th term guys? It will be A plus N minus 1 into D that is the nth term of an AP. So A plus N minus 1 into D. So that is A plus 100 minus 1 into D or you can say 99D. In the same manner 50th term will be A plus 50 minus 1 into D or you can say it is A plus 49D over here. So over here let's simplify just open up this bracket you'll get 2A plus 198D and that is equal to A plus 49D over here. Now if I take these things on the other side of this equation and I subtract what will I get over here? I'll get A plus if I subtract over here, I'm going to get what guys? 149D over here. Now what is this equal to guys? A plus 149D, if you simplify it is nothing but equal to, if I write it properly, it is A plus uh, 150 minus 1 into D, right? A plus 150 minus 1 into D and it is nothing but the 150th term of this AP. So I can say that it is A150 and that is equal to 0. So what does it mean? That A150 or 150th term of this AP is 0. I hope the question is clear to every student watching this video.